Good morning, class family. It's a thankful Thursday. Let's look at the message together. Show me that you're a team and a class family. Follow along with your eyes and listen with your ears. Use your finger to point. Ready? Let's start with today's date. August 24th, 2023. Dear class family, today is Thursday. We will learn a lot at school. First, we will learn letters and sounds. Next, we will listen to a story as a community and share ideas. Then, we will do literacy centers. Last, we will listen to and follow directions in writing. It is a great day. Love, Miss Joyner. Oh, it is a great day. It's Fantastic. Get your fans ready. Fantastic. Let's look back and reread the message. Remember, good readers read things again. It's called rereading. They do this so their brain can understand the words on the page. Use your finger to point. Let's start with the date here. I see the abbreviation for this month. There's a capital letter A, then U, G, and then a period. What does that abbreviation stand for? You're right. If you said August, go ahead and pat yourself on the back. We are in the month of August. Let's go ahead and reread the entire date at this time. August 24th, 2023. After the date, let's reread the greeting, beginning with the word dear. Good writers write letters to people beginning with the word dear and a capital D like D dog D. Let's reread. Dear class family, after the greeting, look at the first sentence. I notice it starts with a capital letter. I see a capital letter T there. Good writers start sentences with capital letters. Let's go ahead and read the sentences in our message to see the sequence of what we're doing at school to find out what we're doing for first, next, then, and last in language arts. Today is Thursday. It is Thursday and it's a thankful Thursday. We will learn a lot at school. Oh, that's true, class family. We do that every day. To be a portrait of a graduate, a great collaborator, communicator, creative and critical thinker. We're going to be an ethical and global citizen as well as goal-directed and resilient individual. As you're learning to do that at school, we're going to really focus on being a great collaborator and communicator. Make sure to speak clearly as you are sharing answers and listen as others are sharing and show respectful choices. That's what good communicators and collaborators do. All right, let's go ahead and see what we're doing here. Oh, I see this transitional word first. It starts with F on F. First, we will learn letters and sounds. We will. We're going to use our word wall as a resource to review the ABCs, letters, sounds, pictures, and match that word, American Sign Language. We're also going to use some YouTube channels, Jack Hartman's YouTube channel, Mr. B, the Singing Walrus, and the Learning Station. We're going to be using your music throughout the school day today in kindergarten. All right, look at this transitional word. I noticed it starts with N, not N. Next, we will listen to a story as a community and share ideas. Okay, we're going to be reading the book called Stick and Stone by Beth Ferry. So we are going to be reading it. I wonder what this book is about. Readers, look at the front cover of the book. Do you see the picture? What do you think Stick and Stone is about? Hmm... Get an idea in your brain. And when it's time to read this story, we are going to be learning some important vocabulary. The words that are going to be in this book that might be new to you are wander. So if someone looks around aimlessly or walks around, they wander. 
explore. We're gonna look for new things. We're gonna explore or go on adventures to explore and vanish to disappear. We're gonna be looking at those vocabulary words as we read the book Stick and Stone. Then we will do literacy centers. We will we'll practice getting uh, containers of books and choosing how to read a book. And we'll practice doing some other literacy centers in class so you can get to know the different resources we're gonna be using at school in language arts. Last, we will listen to and follow directions in writing. Oh, we will. We're going to be practicing with writing workshop. We're going to use our materials, crayons, pencil, paper. We're going to revisit what you were working on yesterday. We'll practice writing our name. We'll add details to your story. We're going to do lots of wonderful things today at school in kindergarten. It is a great day. Love, Miss Shorter. It is a great day. It's fantastic. Get your fans ready. Fantastic. Our do you like question of yes or no answers is, da -da -da, look at the picture first. Do you like flowers? Well, do you? Think about your answer and we're going to be a great communicator. We're going to share yes or no and put a tally mark under that column and your reason why. Do you like flowers? 